Yo, what is up, YouTube? It is Brajley here. I'm bringing you guys another video. In today's video, we're going to be playing some of that sick, nasty 1v1 duel. We're back, boys. That's all I'm going to say. We're back. This is just a regular duel game. It's just going to be for fun. It's the first video back. We're just going to pimp chimp. Uh, that's it. There's nothing more to it. I'm playing for fun. I'm going to try a little bit, but I'm basically playing for fun. I don't care when or lose, rain or shine. We're playing just to enjoy ourselves. Um... I'm going to be thinking of things to do in the future. I plan on uploading more, like actually like taking it serious from now on. And I've given it a lot of thought, and I, I've come to the conclusion that like I genuinely want to do this and put time into it. So I'm going to, and I'm going to put time into it. Hades. So that's going to be something we do. Or I'm going to start doing, I'm going to start uploading, I'm going to make uh, like, you know, an effort. Uh, and a lot of it, and I'm gonna try my best and just have fun while doing it. That was the thing that I was missing out on the last times. I was just uploading, and that was it. I was playing Smite and uploading, and, um, Smite was getting boring at that time. So, I took a small break from Smite. Um, I came back months ago now, but... It, in the grand scheme of things, I took, like, a six-month break. I came back... I've been playing for like seven months now, and um, basically I'm ready to go, you know, just to have fun and enjoy myself in Smite. And I want to make content for you guys, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Make content for you guys, enjoy myself while doing it, that's the plan. And hopefully make it so you guys enjoy watching the content. So I'm here. <laughs> Let's go, baby. I don't know, like, I don't know what more to say. I'm just, I'm super excited. I'm super pumped. I hope you guys are as well. Uh, I hope you guys have been doing really good while, how, for however long I was gone. I hope you guys have been, like, having fun. Chilling. Well, I basically, I mean, I've played the game, but, like, I haven't played the game, like, genuinely to enjoy it in so long. I've been playing it like it was, like, something, I don't know. I was playing it like a job. I like I had a feeling he was gonna do that. I don't know, like he clearly got messed up for it, but I wonder I'm wondering like based off that if Kingfoot Steel is really the play for him. I don't really think it is. I don't think 20% anti-heal early game is good enough. I think especially in duel, yeah, counter building is fantastic, but I think buffing yourself first is more important than counter building. I think making yourself better is more important to do first than trying to make the opponent worse. At least in my opinion. I think the first thing you should do is make yourself better. And then counter the opponent. So he went beads, obviously. Um, Hades. He kind of has to go beads. He's like forced to. Him staying here is a little bit weird. I don't quite know if it's really the play. Because it's fearless. And he's just losing a lot of HP to his tower. Well, that's what I meant with the fearless. Um, really well played on my part if I do something like that. Alright, I, uh, it's actually terribly played on my part. I don't have abilities to do this red buff, and I'm trolling, and I'm AFK in the break. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Do the red buff. Come on. Don't let the stinky Gilgamesh shoot him. He's gonna jump over the wall and steal it, and I'm gonna cry. I see it coming. I see it coming. I see it coming. Stop it. Alright, I'm done. I don't see the future. What am I saying, dude? I'm so wild. I see it, dude, man. Where's my SPL in the way? Dude, I just got the red buff, bro. He's backing off here. He's close. Yeah. I don't... Played aggro, though. The blue's up. Uh, maybe he doesn't know, but, like, he should know because we both did the buff at the same time. I, uh... I don't know. That's a weird play on his part. Because if he stops my back, then I, I need to stay and defend the blue buff. I, I really can't lose it. Like, I got a decent lead, but, like, 
it's not big enough to just give up the boss. Not yet. It'll get there, hopefully. In hopes. We hope. Not yet. They just, like, messed up. Alright. I haven't played against Gilgamesh and Duel yet. Uh, I'm thinking the Tainted Steel probably isn't the play. And I'm assuming you probably want to go, like, Animosity or something. Just based off of, like, what the character does, I would assume Animosity. Like, it's just so strong, I feel. The item is really strong. And then you get Frostbound on the character, like, every game, no matter what. And then to make it even stronger, like, his one does, like, extra damage per auto attack. So you go, like, kin size Animosity, you're doing, like, 200 damage extra every single auto attack on top of the auto attack damage you're already doing. That sounds really strong. No, it's obvious I could be entirely wrong. I have no idea what I'm talking about when it comes to this character. I have, like, played him Duel? Well, I know a lot, like, I know about the character. I play him out of Duel. But... My tracks. He needs to react my dash there. Or, well, he doesn't need to. Actually, preferably he wouldn't, but... If he reacted to my dash, there he lose. I wonder if I push the tower. I think I probably should have pushed the tower. I'm gonna go screw the Magus. Uh, no, I didn't have to. Nice. Your team has Mission's okay, a middle dude. Enemy tower. So I'm gonna go screw the Magus into... Probably... Like a... Polynomicon. I'm assuming this guy's gonna surrender at 5, which is really annoying because I don't want to re-record. I've tried to record this video like 6 times. <laughs> I could have sat in his ult and... What am I doing? I could have sat in his ult and ulted him, is what I wanted to say, until I walked back into his ult. But, uh, he could have died there. I hope he just doesn't know you can surrender at 5 minutes and duel and he waits till 10. Like, I don't want to beat on him for that long, but I also don't feel like he's recording. <laughs> I've done this like 6 times. I haven't played Hades 6 times, which is nice. I've picked different gods, but... I lost two of them. I lost one to a Scotty. Uh, I picked Agni. I, that was dumb. I never should have played Agni. I don't know why I did. But I suck at Agni. He's like one of my least favorite characters to play in Duel, especially. Because it's on one person. Uh, and also, since I'm playing on my alt account, some of the stuff is different. And for whatever reason, I didn't think enough to actually switch his abilities back to what they are on my account. So I have his ult on uh, normal casting and everything else on instant casting, but like, I, I didn't think to switch. I just played the entire game with my ult on instant cast. And like, I was ulting max range off, like flicking ults up and like, ulting 10 million feet behind them and I was just sitting like, bro, what the fuck, why is it going so far? What? And like, I was just sitting there flipping out like, dude, what is this? And it's because, well, those ults just have a range. Man, they just they go far. So he has brawlers now. So I guess he has sixty percent anti heal. I think. I think. If I hit a single auto attack on this guy, he's like dead, and I think he knows it. And I get the feeling that he has that as and like this. It shot an extra shot. His speeds are down. I was gonna say his speeds are down, maybe I'd bait him, but I think it's just smarter to not do dumb stuff. Because <laughs> actually, I don't think his speeds are down. So he's gonna go, I'm assuming, Shogun's. And, um, I'm gonna go. T maybe Obsidian Shard now. Maybe I don't finish Polly and I just start up Ob Shard. We're gonna go right up to Hootie. I don't know, do I have to go Ob Shard for Adventure? Or Shoguns, rather? Assuming he goes Shoguns, I don't know if I need Ob Shard. 
I think I could just go with like a 10% pen action. Of if he goes Genji's, or if he goes Shogun's, rather. I don't really think that I need the huge percent pen option. I'm gonna stop attacking. Oh, what the hell was that? Why did it shoot another turn? The second I hit that auto attack, he's, the second like I hit that auto attack, he needs to not jump him. Because <laughs> uh, I like the fearless. No one understands that. I, I don't like no one plays. No one that does play. What am I saying? No one at a lower level. No disrespect to this guy, right? But I am playing at a lower level than what I am. But uh, no, no disrespect. To this guy, but people that like, play at lower levels don't know how. Hades passive works. So I die here. No, I'm chilling. I'm actually baiting. Yeah. That's a jump out. So I'm gonna turn around, wait 10 seconds, he can't, and then he dies. So I wanna bait his jump again. And then he dies. Basically. DJ there ever was. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. All right, we're chilling. Dude. I know my brain wasn't moving. My brain wasn't moving. Yeah, okay. <laughs> my brain wasn't working. Man. I was just walking straight into the archers. <laughs> Big brain plays. Like Punk Duck would say. Dude. Big brain plays. I'm just gonna finish the Poly Marathon, honestly. I'm gonna finish Poly and Rush Rod, and then yeah, I think we just win. I don't see any way he comes back from this. He did go Genji, so... Um... Maybe the rod's not the play. I don't know. He's gonna have a lot of protections. He hasn't surrendered yet, so he, de he definitely wants to play this game out. So... Maybe... Maybe Offshard is the play. I don't know. I'm gonna sell boots for Offshard. I'm definitely gonna get Offshard. If the game goes that far, because I'm... Or something, but I will go up shirt yeah, for boots. But sadly, I do believe at this point in time, my build is kind of off. That my guy was a bomb. Live on forever. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy team. GG, I suppose. Well, I don't win here, I guess. He's not gonna surrender. I don't know why. Why not? I guess I'm not really mad about it, but... Uh, thanks for not surrendering, actually. <laughs> um, whoa, that was a little tight. Well, not really. Just, uh, weird interaction. Wait a that works. I didn't get hit by his ult. GG! Uh, why did I not get hit by his ult? What? <laughs> it just didn't hit me. <laughs> it just decided otherwise. It was like, yeah, look, I would, but hey, the game's over, dude. It doesn't matter, man. I'm out of here. Anyway, boys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please be sure to leave a like. Uh, be sure to comment down below if you guys have any like recommendations on like gods or like, you know, builds I should try, ideas, like video ideas uh, and things that I can upload in the future. Um, be sure to let me know. And uh, I hope to see you guys on the next video. Uh, I'll leave all my socials and stuff down in the description below. Be sure to go follow those as well.
Uh, I'm not 100% sure if I'll stream on Twitch or if I'll stream on YouTube or what not. I don't know about streams quite yet. I haven't thought about it. I just want to get this video out so you guys know, like, hey, I'm going to start uploading. And I just want to say thank you guys. And peace out. See you guys in the next one.